Hello, Mr. Jacques. I'm Manny. Hello, Manny. Bonjour. Uh, bonjour. Je m'appelle Manny de la Rosa from NBC Palm Springs and the Philippines. De la Rosa. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much and a big congrats. I nailed it, by the way. Did now, you on you're in Palm seven... Spring? Hmm? I'm Did sorry, you what? Now? You are in Palm Spring? I am in Palm Springs. I used to live in Palm Desert. Oh, really? Yeah, for the opening of the Ritz Carlton 32 years ago, I think. Wow. Also, you helped Rancho, open the Ritz Carlton. Rancho Mirage was where the, the hotel was. Right, right, right. And it's still at the Rancho Mirage right now. It's still in the same location, Mr. Jean. And we had, we had the mountain goat every day come to the hotel and eat all the flour. And the gardener was really mad at them. That was very funny. You know, to me, I was, I was just arriving from France and I love that area. Oh my God. I, I, I love Rancho Miras, Palm Spring. I mean, I, I, I love it. I love it. Oh yeah. You're talking about the big horns. Yes, don't, yes, yes, exactly. The big <laughs> they one. miss you, Mr. Jacques. <laughs> <laughs> But a big congrats and nailed it. By the way, now in its seventh season, who knew? Yes, it's so successful, so happy, so much fun. I mean, working with Nicole is always great because she's so fun. And, uh, and you know, eating cake. They are not always good, but we still eat cake. You know, that's, not, that's okay. <laughs> that's right. But real quick, though, tell our viewers what they can expect from season seven from Nailed It. Okay, so I think that the baker may became a little bit better. They are not, look, they are not, They are not good bakers. At the end of the day, there is little time to make those cakes and they will certainly have the fail, but uh, they certainly look at nailed it. They look at the previous episode. They learn from mistakes. So they know that they're supposed to put some paper on the bottom of the cake. So the cake going to come out of the mold, um, that they have to work a little bit faster at the beginning of the bake to be able to finish the cake. That don't happen all the time. Um, And then, you know, uh, they certainly going to see some beautiful fun fail. And it's always so funny. And it's funny to see adults uh, kind of goofing on camera. You know, they, they, the last 10 minutes of the bake, that's when things start to collapse and they start running around and taking that buttercream in their hands and splash the buttercream on the cake <laughs> and try to, need, to do something that looks like what we ask them, but a lot of time uh, don't succeed. And then we have to eat it. That's right. And I can't wait to eat all of them. <laughs> but, but Mr. Jacques, I think the contestants, you guys are great at picking the right contestants. They liven up the show. What are some of the qualifications that you guys look for in a contestant? Uh, I, I think you're right. I think the casting uh, for the show is really good. I think they really pick the right baker. My guess is... Um, We want somebody fun, somebody that is courageous enough to go in front of a camera and yeah. fail in front of millions of viewers, uh, but still have fun, still have a personality and want to, want to succeed into nailed it, but, you know, be, be kind of funny. And, and I have to say that Nicole drive that. Nicole is very good with the bakers. She makes them feel comfortable. She interacts with them. She makes them laugh. And I think Nicole is a big part of that. The, the spirits of the show uh, are the baker, you're right, but it's also Nicole bringing that happiness and, and, and make it fun all the time. Oh, you know what, Mr. Jacques, why do you think people love the show that now it's on its seventh season? But my guess is a lot of kids love the show and make their parents look at it. Yeah. Uh, of course, some adults love the show, but kids, kids I think, are, are a big part of it. And, and again, they love to see adults failing or be goofy on camera. Again, you know, when you see an adult all, all covered with buttercream and trying to put something together and that's something going to fail and they just laugh at themselves. I don't think kids see that every day. They don't see adults doing that every day, but they see it on the show and they recognize it. They laugh about it. I mean, I, I put my show in front, my uh, son, he's six year old, in front of the, the, the show, and I tell him, you know, let's look at that show. And he laughs so hard at the reveal every time, every time. He tells me, he says, Papa, Papa, rerun it, rerun it again, because he wants to see the, the, the fail again, you know? So the kids love that. Oh, finally, Mr. Jacques, what did you learn from all the seven seasons of being in Nailed It? Uh, maybe, maybe don't put your expectations so high, 
because the cakes are not always perfect. Um, but again, it's not about the perfection. Life is not perfect. Yeah. Uh, it's about the family, um, you know, the mom and the daughter, the mom and, and the son, or whoever is in the kitchen making those cakes, having fun, building relationship, do something together, make something from your heart, share it with the rest of the family. And if it's not perfect, it's okay. Life is not perfect. You know, it's it, today kids want perfections. But again, uh, you know, maybe maybe it's, it's asking too much. You know, uh, if it's if it's not perfect, it's okay. Exactly. It's all, everything must be done with love more than anything. I, I agree. I completely agree. Amour. Well, <laughs> <laughs> a big congrats. I nailed it again. Monsieur Jack. <laughs> Merci um, beaucoup. So nice <laughs> to talk to you. I love your smile. Oh, thank you. And it's so successful. This the, the series is so successful. You have a mobile app now and I can't wait to play that. Oh my God, me too. I just play a little bit with it and I love it. You oh, see. and I hope yes. to see you. Hope to see you for season eight and hope to see you back here in the desert. Okay. Thank you very much. Merci beaucoup. Merci nice talking beaucoup. to you.